Hey, hello there, welcome back to the channel. Today we're playing In the Tiger Pete on my free to play account here in ratings. Uh, I'm just grinding up this line on the German lines that I haven't been able to master the, uh, the tier 5s and 6s, a lot of them. So I've carried on going to tier 7, ran out of money unfortunately, so we're playing in ratings here, but we haven't got all our equipment equipped. We've got the full crew, but we've only got the first four pieces of equipment uh, stocked up. So I'm playing in ratings and just trying to see how we get on. I've actually just bought the tank, so we're. we're Heading over to be here on Winter Balancova, being ratings, we are bottom tier as it's a tier 7. It's one of those tanks that I think has been kind of um, muscled out in terms of its uh, its ability in the game. It's been, you know, sort of, tanks around it have all been buffed up and it, this really hasn't changed that much in a long, long time. It used to be a good tank, it's still got a lot of good things going for it to be fair. Um, it has got a good, decent alpha gun. It's got about 220 on the top gun. And uh, let's try and get a shot in there. The aiming time is fairly slow though. Um, and it has got a fairly rapid fire. So it's got about a DPM of about 2,200. Uh, and the pen is, pen is actually fairly good for its tier as well. So if you can get it in the right place and get the gun firing, it's got about a five second reload. Uh, you, can, you can put some damage on the enemy. I'm just shooting the top of this VK5545 battery because I can't pen in from this angle or this distance. And uh, I'm just going to try and damage some modules. We've got some free shots. There's nobody else doing anything around me, so it's it's worthwhile. Got shot on the side of him there, 191. The armor is still fairly good for its tier, really. It's got a very solid front front plate, a bit bit stronger than the Tiger 1 even. And um, see, the aim time is not that great in terms of getting that reticle to, to lie in, especially with not all the equipment stocked. I've got an FV201 there, who's asking to be shot. It's got some a really weak front plate, if people can aim, and of course the coupler on top of the turret is, is one of its major weak spots. But uh, if you can keep it straight on and don't get the angle over-angled, you, you can actually do fairly well. Uh, the side eye armor is, is very weak if you if you over angle it, so it's, it's a case of knowing getting to know the angles and where you can go. You're much better off going face on to people um, and just get that gun working. Managed to take out the VK45. We've got two kills on the board, which is going well. Um, so it's awfully slow. It seems to be very slow. I've only got the first four pieces of equipment equipped here. Uh, can't afford the rest of them. Um, about 170k credits, which. Really, I should grind on somewhere else, but I'm, I'm trying to use the, the free XP tokens, which is it's one of the bad things about WG. They give you lots of these times 10 or times 5, and uh, just have to try and take that shot. But he, unfortunately, the aiming was not that great. Um, but in terms of using the XP tokens, you really want to use them on the tanks where you need to. I'm grinding up this, this German line. Um, not being able to manage, to manage to master a lot of the tier 5s and 6s. It's very, very... Lots of competition at uh, with the with the five k queues, I think. Um, so I might as well use the, the free tokens on this account and move forward. We should be able to get a shot on him. Go forward degrees of elevation. Just managed to do that there. It's two versus three. We are three kills on the board. There's a basilisk there, but the elephant is going to be uh, the, the danger tank. There, he's, he's he's got a heavy hitting gun, and he'll be able to pen me unless. In fact, it probably even pen my front plate, actually. Uh, it's got about 200 mils of armor, maybe if you angle the front, but uh, if you can aim, then it's gonna be it's gonna be trouble for us. Yeah, look, there we go, he's gone straight through the side of the uh, of the tank there. Can we get a shot back in on him? No, he's put another one on 97. Oh dear. <laughs> We've got four kills on the board there, but we've just gotta get our friend in the WZ112 Celestial to come and help. Um, I can't afford to take another hit. And the elephant, this is one of those up, overpowered tanks that they've put into the game. It's, it's on a fair and chassis, which is good enough as it is, but they've, they've increased its, its uh, rate of fire and its DPM and its penetration. And we just don't want to get shot by him there. The WZ is on a one there. We need to go one side each. He needs to get him to turn and uh, he needs to come forward. I'm trying to tell the guy to do it, whether he's listening to me or not. I don't know. Hopefully, he needs to go make him turn. We have got the cap so we can sway. He needs to come forward and, and actually do something because without killing us, we have got the cap on top of him. Can we get a shot in there? We can. Just make sure we do some shooters. He's going to have to come and kill us. Otherwise, it's 1925. He's going to lose otherwise. Just don't don't go and don't go and fight him. He's coming towards me. This is great. 
just keep him spotted so we can see where he is. The WZ needs to come forward there, he's turned, he's going for the WZ. We've got his ammo rack as well, it's going to be good. Put a track on him, if we can just keep him tracked now, this is where the DPM really comes into its own. You can just uh, aim in there, just keep him tracked, he's got no chance really. Got the four kills, 2.5k damage, we'll just keep it going now, he's not going to be able to do us. One way or the other, oh, could have maybe kept on tracking him. Got the uh, over angle there. Five kills the Radleys and uh, nearly 3k damage. Uh, unexpected Ace Mastery on it. Uh, I've only, it's only about second or third game in it. There's my first calibration battle. <laughs> 2992 Mastery, Top Gun. We've got the Radley Walters as well. Uh, 63 damage assisted. Uh, 108k and 54 take home. And. Um, it's still a solid tank if you can play it nicely. Don't keep yourself out of trouble. But as I say, it's been power crept by the rest of the the tier 7s and 8s. Uh, did well to survive and do as well as we did there. It just all fell nicely for me. 2992, uh, 5 kills. And we've got... We don't know what the base XP is on it because it's, it's a ratings game. But uh, I'll have to guess on that one. But <laughs> hope you enjoyed it anyway. And uh, we'll see you in the near future with another nice battle. Bye for now.